I'm here with Eric, one of the admins from the uh, NAG LAN. Hi, Eric. How's it going? Find yourself. Good, good. Um, I see you're actually incredibly busy, so thank you so much for the time. Um, do you want to give me some of the things you guys are... What, what is, what's involved in being an admin here? Uh, well, it depends on where in the world you do it, because if you go to one of the overseas events like DreamHack, which is the biggest event, uh, they have specialized crew focusing on one specific area. If you're here by Rage and you're one of my admins, then you kind of focus on whatever needs attention. So we do have specialities where one guy might be able to look after the website, another guy looks after DC++ or uh, networking or whatever. But in all, most of the guys are versed in just about everything. So they can look after just about any hassle. So the admins, they take care of any of the issues the guys have connecting to a game, connecting to the network, not finding uh, IP addresses from the servers. So that type of issues, that's basically what the admins look after. Cool. Um, I can see you guys actually have an incredible amount of network switches and stuff here. How long did it take you guys to set all that up? Well, we've got uh, three different levels on which we set okay. up. So the first level is the Do Gaming LAN, which is below uh, in the banqueting area. Now, that we started on Sunday. So we started from about 8 till, I don't know, about 7. And then the rest of the LAN we started from Monday on this level, basically up here. And we finished last night just before 12. Cool. So it's a while. I can imagine. How many PCs are you guys expecting to get actually on your network? Uh, all the PCs, it's 2,194 PCs that are supposed to be here. And as an uh, interesting fact, uh, the ticket sold out in four hours. I oh, know, we saw that. It was quite yeah. incredible. You guys yeah. are doing quite well. Yeah. What's your day job that you manage to get involved with uh, the ad administration of the land? Day job is kind of a bit difficult to explain. Okay. Um, the official title would be a senior analyst, um, okay. but I kind of design plants and build plants and get the automation side of it up and running. So I'm more into PLCs and software coding and okay, that, that right. type of side of things. Yeah. All right. How do you get involved with the uh, NAG? Well, this, this is kind of a hobby that uh, we did a couple of lands because we wanted more than two people to play against. So we organized the first couple of lands and somehow it worked out that we did the first ESWC uh, with uh, NAG, and then so it carried on. And then we did Rage, um, and we just kind of got stuck here. So they haven't replaced us yet. So it seems we're not doing too much wrong. Job. <laughs> yeah. Cool. What's the hardest part of actually doing and setting this thing up? Well, the hardest part would be relying on other people to get stuff done, because with event this size, there are bound to be a lot of different people involved, um, and a different a lot of different rule sets so you might not get access where you want to and one of the issues we had on this year is the good food and wine show was here before us so they had to clear out the venue before we could move in so you have those type of issues that, that kind of crop up um, then the really worst part for most of the team is the walking so you end up walking oh i just need to go and fix one cable it's only 150 meters there 150 meters back and you do that 20, 30 times a day, so it becomes quite a distance. Yeah. So I think people don't realize how much space you guys are actually spanning with this land, which is quite amazing. Because yeah. I know it runs uh, almost uh, 180 degrees around uh, the dome, and you're upstairs and downstairs. Yeah, the 180 degrees, if you walk around it on the inner rim, that relates to about 100 meters. So from this end to the other end is about 100 meters. Um, then we have all the floor space down here in the bottom. And then we also have the telecom section, which is in the banqueting hall. So, yes, we do spend quite a bit. Thanks for talking to us. All right, cool stuff. <laughs>